Teen Investigates is uncovering disturbing details about a convicted sex offender allegedly exposing himself to children in Colorado Springs. The suspect, who police say has gang ties, has been in and out of jail three times in the past year. The latest crime police say at Helen Hunt Park in Colorado Springs. Cardio 13 investigator Sean Rice is live to explain what he has uncovered about this case. Sean. Yeah, Barton Heather, Colorado Springs police caught 40 year old David Dean here at Helen Hunt Playground in Colorado Springs. Police allege he was touching himself inappropriate to young children who were playing at the park. Dean, a registered sex offender, is someone police believe is a well is a part of a well known gang. And tonight we're tracking his journey through the criminal justice system and how he got back on the streets. This is David Dean standing in front of a jailhouse camera not once, but three separate times since August of last year. Colorado Springs police say he was, quote, trying to fight people and was trying to stab people at this roadway in last year. Prosecutors charged him with attempted assault. He posted his $10,000 bond a few months later. Two months after getting out of jail, police say he was caught on video firing a gun at an apartment off Fillmore Street. The victim's family tells Cardio 13 investigates they didn't even know Dean before the shooting. In this case, Dean was charged with attempted murder and got a $50,000 bond recommended by the court. Well, that might make sense on a run of the mill attempted murder. It makes a lot less sense when you have a guy who's on bond for another charge that's very similar and then who engages in more behavior that likely leads to the death of other human beings. Former 18th Judicial District Attorney George Brockler says Colorado's bond requirements just aren't strict enough. This one is particularly unique given the gravity of the offenses that are alleged and the final one that got him rearrested. But I wish I could tell your viewers that this is uncommon. It's not. Police ultimately rearrested Dean at this park three weeks later his third arrest in eight months, accused of touching himself to kids playing at the park. It is simply inexplicable that this person would be on the street to go to a park and pleasure them in, in front of pleasure themselves in front of innocent kids. Cardio 13 investigates reached out to those judges who set these bond amounts. They couldn't comment on any of Dean's open cases, but a spokesperson did emphasize that each bond set was within what is recommended by the chief judge. Dean's defense attorney also has not responded to our request for comment. Reporting live in studio, Sean Rice, Cardio 13 Investigates.